Imagine a ship so colossal that it could contain three football fields laid end to end. This is no mere fantasy, but a reality that once graced our oceans. We are talking about a leviathan of steel and iron, a testament to human ingenuity and ambition. The Seawise Giant. At over 1,500 feet in length, it dwarfed every other vessel that dared to share the ocean with it. Its enormity can be best understood by envisioning the ship as three football fields lying end to end. This illustration may seem far-fetched, but it is an authentic representation of the Seawise Giant's mammoth dimensions. The ship's ability to carry cargo was equally astounding. It had an astonishing capacity of two million barrels of oil, a figure that is hard to fathom. To give you a sense of its scale, imagine over 300 Olympic-sized swimming pools filled to the brim with oil. That's not simply a lot, but a gargantuan amount that would even make oil tycoons catch their breath. The ship's mind-boggling size and cargo capacity made it a marvel of maritime engineering. It stood as a symbol of the seemingly impossible feats that humanity could achieve. Yet, it's true. The Seawise Giant, the largest ship ever built, was as real as the sea it sailed upon. This mind-boggling vessel could carry a staggering two million barrels of oil. That's enough to fill over 300 Olympic-sized swimming pools. Now that's a lot of oil. But the Seawise Giant is just the tip of the iceberg. As we delve into the depth of the maritime world, it's imperative to appreciate the journey that shipbuilding has undergone. Originating as a humble craft, it was an art form mastered by who lived by the shores, using simple tools and resources available to them. Over time, it evolved. The process wasn't sudden. It was a gradual transformation, mirroring the advancement of human civilization. As centuries passed, the art of shipbuilding became more complex, integrating elements of science. The advent of technology has played a significant role in this transformation. Sophisticated tools, innovative materials, and advanced engineering techniques have replaced the rudimentary methods of the past. This evolution has not just impacted the efficiency and speed of these sea vessels, but also their size. Result is a marvel to behold. Ships that are larger than life. True waterborne leviathans that dwarf anything seen in previous eras. The construction of these colossal ships is a testament to human ingenuity and a symbol of how far we've come. So, ready to embark on a voyage of discovery? Let's set sail on a journey through time, exploring the ten largest ships ever built. Our voyage begins in the early 20th century with the Titanic. This colossal ocean liner is a symbol of human ambition and technological prowess of its era. Measuring an impressive 882 feet, it was a marvel of engineering, dwarfing other seafaring vessels of that period with its sheer size and opulence. Titanic, the epitome of luxury, was meticulously crafted to be the epitome of comfort and safety, setting new benchmarks for transatlantic travel. Its immense size was matched by its exquisite interiors, resplendent with the finest amenities of its time. Grand staircases, ornate dining rooms, and luxurious staterooms, the Titanic had it all. This floating palace was designed to offer an unparalleled travel experience for its privileged passengers. Its maiden voyage, however, was a stark contrast to its grandeur, was a fateful journey that would forever mark the pages of maritime history. The mammoth liner, deemed unsinkable, met with an unthinkable fate. When the Titanic struck an iceberg in the North Atlantic, it sent shockwaves around the world, marking a tragic end to its maiden voyage. The disaster served as a grim reminder of the perilous power of the sea, underlining the stark contrast between human ambition and the unforgiving nature of the ocean. Tragically, the Titanic's maiden voyage ended in disaster serving as a stark reminder of the power of the sea. Fast forward to the mid-20th century, and we meet the Queen Mary II. This isn't just any ship. This is a superbly sculpted, floating embodiment of human ingenuity and perseverance, a monument to the audacity of our dreams, as grandiose as the aspirations that fuel our progress and ambitions. The Queen Mary II is an epitome of luxury, a beacon of sophistication and refinement in an often chaotic and disorderly world. 
With every inch of its magnificent frame bearing testament to the marvel of human engineering, this giant amongst marine vessels boasts an extraordinary length of 1,132 feet. To provide a sense of scale to this staggering measurement, let's draw parallels with a universally recognized monument. Imagine, if you will, the Eiffel Tower, a stalwart symbol of France's architectural prowess. A structure that inspires awe and captivates millions with its grand stature. Now think about this. The Queen Mary II is even longer than the Eiffel Tower is tall. Yes, you heard that right. This luxury liner is not just a testament to human achievement, but a formidable challenger for nature's own towering marvels. As we move into the 21st century, ship sizes continue to grow. This robust growth in ship size reflects the advancements in naval architecture and marine engineering. Vessels like the Emma Maersk, for example, showcase this evolution quite dramatically. The Emma Maersk, a container ship that was launched in the year 2006, is a testament to human ingenuity and our abilities to construct massive structures. The sheer dimensions of this ship are staggering. At 1,300 feet long, it's almost as long as four football fields laid end to end. Just to give you a perspective, it's more than two times the size of the Titanic, which was once considered the largest ship. What's more impressive is its carrying capacity. The Emma Maersk is designed to carry a staggering number of 11,020 foot equivalent units. This measurement in shipping is commonly referred to as TEU, and it is a standard way to measure a ship's cargo carrying capacity. Just to visualize, imagine stacking 11,000 standard shipping containers on a single ship. This is not just about the size, but it's a masterpiece of modern logistics and supply chain management. It is efficient, eco-friendly, and helps to keep the global trade machinery running smoothly. It's a symbol of how far we've pushed the boundaries of engineering and technology. That's a lot of cargo. Indeed, Emma Maersk is a clear demonstration of how much ship sizes have grown as we sail further into the 21st century. Next, we encounter the TI-class supertankers, a quartet of colossal vessels measuring nearly 1,500 feet. Simply imagine a ship that extends beyond the length of five football fields placed end to end. These maritime giants are an engineering marvel, a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. Their length is not their only impressive feature. They are also incredibly wide, adding to their astonishing overall size. Born from necessity, these ships play a pivotal role in global commerce, specifically in the oil industry. The story of their creation is one of challenge, innovation and ultimate triumph. They were designed to tackle the most formidable of sea voyages, braving all sorts of weather conditions, from the calmest days to the most tempestuous storms. Their robust structure and gargantuan size enable them to carry an almost unimaginable cargo, up to three million barrels of oil. This is no small feat. To put it in perspective, that's enough oil to fill over 170 Olympic-sized swimming pools. Every single journey they undertake is a testament to how mankind has harnessed the powers of engineering to shape global commerce and influence geopolitical landscapes. They are more than just ships. They are floating fortresses of industry, and their contribution to the world economy is invaluable. And so, these behemoths can transport up to three million barrels of oil across the globe. But even these pale in comparison to the prelude flang, this floating natural gas facility, launched in 2013, measures an astounding 1,600 feet. The Prelude is more than a ship. It's a floating city, complete with living quarters, factories and storage facilities. Finally, we arrive at the Seawise Giant. This supertanker, launched in the late 20th century, is the largest ship ever built. Measuring an unbelievable 1,502 feet, the Seawise Giant could carry over two million barrels of oil. From the ill-fated Titanic to the colossal Seawise Giant, the progression of shipbuilding technology is truly awe-inspiring. As we look to the future, who knows what maritime marvels await us? Will we see ships that dwarf even the Seawise Giant? Only time will tell. For now, we can only marvel at the ten largest ships ever built, testaments to human ingenuity, and the relentless pursuit of progress.